we are back and today I'm just sharing a super simple under five minute mom makeup tutorial that's perfect for those days that you just have zero time and just want to look a little bit better like you put a little bit of effort in but really didn't <laughs> you know the days I'm talking about this is the completed look. I'm using the Jane Iredale products today. I'm gonna show you guys their Pure Pressed Base Mineral Foundation, which is really awesome because it's a multitasking product and I'm all about that. Um, this is what it looks like. It's basically a foundation, concealer, and sun protection all in one. So the coverage is sheer to full, and I like that because if you just want a little something, you can just brush it on, or if you want a little bit fuller of a coverage, you can kind of build it up a bit just to cover, especially if you have like acne scarring or anything like that. Like I know my, my skin tone scars are more prominent on it. I have that olive Italian skin tone. So I need a little bit more coverage, especially over in those areas. And I like that you can do that if you want to. So there's two ways you can apply the Jane Iredale Pure Pressed Base Mineral Foundation. You can use the handy brush, which looks like this, super cute. And you can simply just dab and brush it on and be done with it. I, this will give you a little bit more of a sheer coverage, but if you're looking for a fuller coverage or if you wanna really conceal, like I have terrible under eye circles, you guys know that. If you wanna really conceal those dark circles, you can use their flocked sponge. This is what I'm gonna use today because I want a little bit more of fuller coverage and I it, it gives it, trust me, wait till you see the before. <laughs> I'm also gonna be using the Jane Iredale Hydration Sprays. There's actually three sprays total, and they all kind of do the same, but a little bit different things. Um, they're basically all a setting spray, so you put these on after you apply the foundation, and they help it, they help give it lasting power throughout the day, but they're also really great for your skin, and so each of them will do a variety of things. You have the D2O hydration spray, and this is really great for people who have dryness, itching, redness, things like that. It's very sensitive skin because it helps calm it down and also helps balance the oil in your skin. Then there's the Balance Hydration Spray, and this is really great for people with acne-prone skin because it helps balance that oil, as well as provide other really great skincare benefits as well, but definitely a good one for those of you with acne. And then there's the Pomace Hydration Spray, and this is the one I'm actually gonna use today because it's meant for all skin types. My skin type right now is pretty normal. I'm not more oily or dry, and I don't know if that's just this pregnancy, maybe, um, or if it's just the skin products I'm using, but um, I'm not really in need of anything else. So this one calms, soothes, protects, it kind of does everything in one, um, and this is what I'm gonna use today. So again, this is the completed look, super simple. It's gonna take you under five minutes. It's perfect for busy moms or if you're just a busy person in general. So let's get to it. All right, guys, so this is me, no makeup. Um, although I did fix my brows a little bit, but <laughs> we're gonna have this be quick because we're moms, we have no time, right? So again, we're using the Jane Iredale Pure Pressed Base Mineral Foundation, and I'm gonna use their flocked sponge to apply. So the great thing about this, you can simply just dab it on. and it actually gives really good coverage. So this is great if you are a tired mom or just don't have a lot of time as it is. I don't know, I remember being like that in nursing school. I didn't even have kids in nursing school and I just had no time for anything. Um, but if you're in kind of a rush and you just want something that'll give you good coverage. I always like to get my eyelids too because for some reason, those get really discolored on me. And I'm just kind of tapping it in, but also blending a bit. And if you want to keep building, 
like under my eyes for concealer. Um, you can just keep building it up. And boom! Done. Now listen, if you're not a big makeup wearer and you just want to go out the door with just a little bit more of an even skin tone, you can totally do this and be on your way. I like to at least throw a little coat of mascara and a little lip gloss on. Um, I just feel like it makes my eyes look less tired. <laughs> so, so I'm going to do that and I'll be right back. All right, so I just added a coat of mascara and a little lip gloss to just brighten my face up a little bit, but that's definitely not necessary. And the last step is using one of the Jane Iredale's hydration sprays. These are actually really great because they set your makeup in place and they also have a lot of skincare benefits as well. So I'm using the Pomist one. This one um, is actually for all skin types, just gives a little bit of hydration and like I said, it's gonna set things. So, ooh, and it smells amazing. Could like eat that. Ooh. All right, guys, that's it. That's the completed look. How ridiculously easy was that, right? Like probably under three minutes, especially if you don't want to throw on mascara or anything like that. So. I don't know. I'm hooked. Like I, this is definitely going to be a product I'm reaching for repeatedly because sometimes I just don't have time. <laughs> like really sometimes or the energy. Sometimes I don't have the energy to want to actually put makeup on, but I don't want to look like I just got out of bed. That's it. I hope you guys enjoyed and there's going to be more tutorials to come. So thanks for watching.